Hello, dear friends in Colombia. My name is Kun Temis. I'm a teacher in Belgium, and this year we will be launching the Climate Action Project for the fourth time in October, and this will be running for six weeks. During the project, which is student-centered, the students will be able to explore, to brainstorm, to discuss, to create, to have fun, and to share their findings via very brief videos, which will be published at our website. And this way, students are not able to learn from your, the teacher and the other students in the classroom, but also from peers from across the world, from every continent, even Antarctica. Why is it important for you to join this project? Well, you will be offered guidelines, a personal facilitator who will personally guide you, a curriculum, and you will be offered the opportunity to brainstorm with other teachers from Latin America, but also from across the world. We will be having a lot of participants this year from Argentina, Peru, um, Chile, but even Guatemala, Bolivia, and a few from uh, Venezuela. So you will be able to exchange best practices with other teachers, but also communicate, have conversation, and interact. We feel that there are better ways to teach students about climate change than just asking them to memorize definitions. We want them to solve problems and even take action. We want them to target creativity, collaboration, even on a global scale, problem solving and empathy, because that is so important for the future. We will show how to bring STEM in your classroom and we will make sure that the students will be offered really interesting opportunities. This year, they will be even able to send their messages and their solutions to Mars, thanks to our collaboration with NASA, the UN and WWF. Last year, the project created a lot of impact. We had 100,000 participants and we planted 1 million trees during two single weeks. We had students in Malawi who planted trees. We had uh, students creating a solar suitcase, their own bioplastics, 3D printed coral reefs, but also eco-friendly cars by uh, Catherine in Colombia um, in cardboard. So that is basically what we want to do. We want to change mindset and behavior, not only in the classroom, but also in the community. So hopefully you will be joining us in the Climate Action Project this year. Thank you.